Welcome to Tech Talk. My name is Hannah Bro. You are watching this on Perry Girls TV. And you can find me on my regular handle at Dogtown Drive. If you're watching this on the replay, please tweet this out, share it with your followers, invite everybody that you can, tell your mom, share it on Twitter, because I'm going to show you some stuff tonight that is going to improve your Periscope broadcast. We're going to increase engagement and make you a better broadcaster. So as you're joining, please swipe, share, comment, say hello. Thank you, Gia, for sharing on Twitter. Julie Jordan Scott shared on Twitter and shared with all her followers. Rice and Spam shared with all of their followers. Do you see that now? The hearts are starting to come up over here. Thank you for tapping hearts. Hello, everyone, says Nanny on the town. Fist bumps from Gia. Yay for increased engagement. Peglet, Peggy, it's good to see you. Mr. Felix and Anderson at Fowl, Richard Fowl, Celia Keebler, it's good to have you here. Thank you for coming in, perrydudes.com. So what you are looking at right now is Broadcaster Pro. This is a brand new uh, Chrome extension for your Periscopes. It is specifically for Periscopes. We see a lot of stuff that's live streaming. We're seeing new cameras coming out for Facebook Live. That is all fantastic. You are very welcome, Richard. It's great to have you here. And so if you are one of those people, I'm going to flip you guys around just for a moment. CB Wallace, Carol, do you like that? Isn't that neat? It is so much cooler than just trying to read the comments on your phone. So I'm going to flip you guys around. I'm going to say hi, and we are going to jump right in. So I got to get you out of my little Archon mount here. Hi, Lynn. How are you? Welcome, everybody. Thank you for being here. So what we are going to end tonight, we are going to stop this from happening. I know that you have seen this happen. So a comment comes in. Somebody's talking. They're doing really great. They're looking at the screen right in the camera and they're telling you like it is and somebody comments. And what do you see? This. No more. No more. We understand. Hey, Flora and PG Ninjas. We get it. It's hard to see. The comments are little. But this is not what is not a great broadcast it's okay if you want to be clever with it write something on your forehead and then when you do it but get this you don't have to do that anymore there are some amazing third-party options so you can see the text a lot bigger first one we're going to talk about is broadcaster pro so real quick this is tech talk it happens on friday nights here on perry girls tv right here the channel you're watching so make sure you share this out with your followers and please click on the little perry girl because it is a perry girl we found that out. Click on the little Perry girl down there in the comment and follow this account, please, because there's probably somebody that's following you that does this. And if you're brand new, this is extra important because maybe brand new people are following you. Let's get this information out there. Tech Talk happens here on PGTV every Friday night, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, hosted by at Web Evie. Evie or me, Hannah at Dogtown Drive, and we help you translate nerd to normal. If you are a woman on Periscope, Come join our group, perrygirls.com. We are a free online Facebook group for you to get involved, and we help you get better at everything by sharing what we know. That's how it works. So let's just jump right in. Do you like that sign, Lynn? Thank you. Okay, I'm going to flip you guys around. We're going to look at Broadcaster Pro. So how do you get this? Everybody can have it. There, This is a free app. And while you guys are in here, I'm going to be reading the comments over on the screen. So there we go. Such big Winkelman Udu Manning. Thank you for being here. I want you guys to notice something that's really cool about this. So not only are we seeing the usernames at Go Rice Girl, but we also see their actual name. A lot of people's name is not their handle. So that is a way that you are increasing engagement. People like to hear their name. So when people are coming in and you're welcoming and you're saying hello, Nat at Natasha Self Care Hard Hardy Core Fitness, welcome. It is so good to have you. It is awesome, Celia. So how you guys can get this. This is for the Chrome browser, so you need to... <laughs> Joanne Pham, Go Rise Girl, the Perry Girls founder. Look at that. Isn't that fun? Okay, so this is how you do it. This is Chrome, so you need to have Chrome installed. If you do not already have it, google.com slash Chrome, because Chrome is a Google browser. Let me just tilt you guys up just a little bit. So up here in the corner of your Chrome browser, you're going to see a little thing. It's got three dots. Yours is probably not going to be red, because I bet your Chrome is updated. Hello, Thomas from Oregon. You know what? That is totally okay. This is for everybody. Can you do it on Chrome browser or on iPad? Well, test it out for me, Heather. Let me know. 
let me know. If you can add extensions, then definitely. But this information is for everybody. The girls group is just for girls, but perrydudes.com. So up in the corner, your Chrome is probably updated, so it's just that. So there we go. Okay, you got that. Uh, pull it down. This is how I, how I get to find it. So I go to, to, I'm sorry, this is, what is this I am looking at? We are looking at Broadcaster Pro. This is Chrome and you're on Periscope. Yes, I, I apologize, King at Demige. I mean, you're saying reasonable stuff, but that is totally just like way out there. Yes, in the upper right-hand corner, I go down to more tools and we're going to go over to extensions. And this is just kind of a cheat. You can get to this place in other ways. But scroll down to the bottom, and you're going to see Get More Extensions. Opening up, Get More Extensions. Now, if you go into Chrome, don't do this. I'm going to show you this first one. And we'll zoom in just a bit here. So in your search, here's a thing. If you search, you know, Broadcast Pro, this is what's going to show up. Scroll down. You see this one, desktop plugin for Periscope? This is not it. This is not the one you want. You do not want this desktop plugin for Periscope TV. That is wrong. So we're going to go back and we are going to search. We're going to delete that space. It needs to be all one word and it needs to say Broadcaster Pro. All one word. And we're going to search that. This is the one you're looking for. That's the one by I am Joe Taylor. Whoever you are, Joe Taylor, thank you. So I've already gotten it, but over here when you're installing it, yes, all one word, Judith, awesome, thank you. Go ahead, install it, and then up here, this will show up, and it'll give you a little option. You can turn it off or turn it on. When it is on, it will be blue. Once you have it. Oh, he's a Periscope designer? Oh, Thanks, Joe. That's awesome. Thanks for that information, Judith. Are you guys still? Oh, you are still zoomed in. There we go. Okay. So once it's in, all you have to do is go to Periscope TV dot Periscope dot TV slash whatever your username is created by Joe on the Periscope web team. Oh, awesome, Joe. Thank you. This is awesome. You did it the first day it was announced. It's really cool. Broadcaster Pro, all one word. And then you just go to your page. You can actually go to anybody's and um, and have the text increased. Is this site free? Yes. Broadcaster Pro is free. So don't get the one that's 99 cents. That's not the right one. And you'll notice some weird user permissions on the one that's 99 cents. Broadcaster Pro, free. Totally free. It's just a way for you to get bigger text. And why does it increase engagement? Nanny on the town, Sarah Brown, is because you can actually talk to people a lot easier. Another benefit is that you guys are over here in my phone and I can see the computer wherever, you know, wherever I have this. Can I explain the last bit, please, about how you sign in? So after you install, that's a good point. So after you install Broadcaster Pro, and that's there, you'll go to just a regular page and pull up. Periscope.tv slash, and I'm going to pull up our page since that's what we're brought, Perry Girls TV. You hear him? Yeah, my husband is feeding the dogs, so they're making some racket and then that will show it up. We have a little timer coming up, and since I have it running, I don't know, since I have it running on both pages, you'll see a small thumbnail down there, Boop. and then the comments will start coming up. My cat was like, what, says Rachel Payne at Creativity Tribe. So I really like Broadcaster Pro. The people I've been seeing use it, use it have really enjoyed it, and I mean, you can't argue with free, and it answers a, qu a problem that a lot of people had, which was being able to see the comments. Isn't that neat, Makisha? I'm glad you like it. Thomas, yes, yeah, see, it's for every bear, everybody. Isn't there a timer? Yes, but I have not consistently been able to make the timer work for me, and so I am not going to talk about it. <laughs> Can't wait to use it. Celia, yes, it's so neat. It, it really adds another element. You know, people want that dual broadcasting ability without having, you know, where you're 
not dual broadcasting per se, but being able to have the camera in a different location from where you're actually sitting. So if you're somebody, I'm gonna flip you guys around just for a moment before we go back and talk about egg drop. So if you are somebody that, you know, scopes, let's say you do art scopes and you have your awesome Archon mount and it's above you, it's watching down, you're watching exactly great for artists. You're using that HD8 RV amazing tall Archon mount. You can now have your phone above you and run your computer instead of having a second device. You can use your laptop to still see those comments so that you're able to engage with your viewers. And that's what it is. It's for engagement. You need comments that big on your phone. Mm -hmm. And that's what this answer is because this, this isn't helping anybody. This isn't, that's not the view. Yes, I'm glad. And you know what? Make sure, just, uh, thanks, Joe. Great for animal trainers too. It is so, so helpful. Using it will learn you help you learn it. Using it will help you learn it. Yes, that's exactly right. The best way to learn this stuff is to get in there and start poking buttons and pressing things. Forehead cam. You are very welcome. We're not done yet. I got about 15 more minutes. I'm going to talk to you guys about egg drop. Egg, DRP, you have probably seen, heck, you're watching on the web right now, right? You get to see the comments more and you can see it. Egg, DRP, you've probably seen the hashtag. I use the hashtag in this broadcast, egg, DRP.com. You can go to this site right now. Also starts it free. There are some paid options, which we will talk about. You can archive your broadcasts. How many of you guys remember Catch? So let's, we're gonna do the flipperoo again. So Catch, if you guys are brand new to Periscope, or even not that new because it's been a little bit, um, Catch was a site that saved your broadcasts for you so that you could send people to your Catch, RIP Catch, right? You could send them to your Catch page and um, they would be able to see your archive broadcasts. Did you know, did you know you can call people by their name as a viewer? Isn't that fun? Do you know if you can use, okay, you guys help each other out, answer some questions. <laughs> um, let me pull this up. So Eggdrop will also archive your scopes. That's the point. That's what I'm getting at. And Eggdrop was made by Joey. He's an amazing periscoper, part of the community. And um, I, I, I personally really like Eggdrop. Eggdrop. Egg, I say Eggdrop. Um, and let me show you why. So ba, ba, ba. flipping you again, you're going... That's my messy studio. You're going back in the Archon mount on my computer and we're gonna check out Egg Drop. If you guys are on your computer right now, you can be doing this at the same time too. Okay, here we are. Here we are, Egg Drop. So eggdrp.com, that's the site up top there that you want to go to and you forget about it. You know what? I had been, but then this tech talk came up and I got on there and I saw so many more amazing features that I didn't even know that they had been working on. Is this also Chrome browser? Yes, I am also using Chrome for this. Hey Pete, how are you? I hope you're doing okay. You've been inspiring some amazing scopes from people. So if you go to eggdrop.com, this is the site you're going to see. You're going to check out the features. We have all of this on here. And I'm trying to read the comments at the same time as doing the computer. Honestly, it's way tougher. See some amazing featured people. Oh, who's that? Oh, it's Joanne, Echo Rice Girl. Who else do I see myself? Ta-da! You can't type much, but sure tapping. Thank you so much for tapping the hearts. Okay, so just exploring the egg drop site. If you go over here, this will bring you... Ooh, it's kind of hard to see, right? Is my... Oh, that is my headphone. Thanks, Heather. I'm still here. I'm talking so you guys can hear me and it's not just dead air. All right. So click on the lock over here on the left hand side and I can tell it's kind of it's gray on black. So it's a little hard to see, but the lock will let you create a free account. I have already made an account for this. Do I have time to review broadcasters? What do you mean? Because I what do you, what would you like reviewed? And I'm just gonna make you guys flip you, I'm gonna flip you for just a moment while I type in a password and talk to you. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I swear I practiced this. Okay, so Broadcast Pro. Do I have time to review Broadcast Pro? I would, uh, I would enjoy it. I talked about Broadcast Pro at the beginning, and so I would start, I would start there and, and just get in there and explore it. Um, I, so far, I really like it. 
So that would be my review thusly, is I really like it. Okay, so I just logged in. Hey, Michelle Hayward, logged in over here on Eggdrop, and I'm gonna show you what the page looks like so you can see some of the fun. Apologies for the back and forth. I hope the connection is holding when I'm flipping the camera. Dave, stay here. All right, so I have logged in on the lock. You can create a free account. Why do you want to create a free account? Because when you go now to your profile, did I not sign up? Okay, just bear with me. Oh, okay, <laughs> apologies. So this is to sign up if you wanna become a PayPal or a, a premium account user on Eggdrop. Is full scope worth paying for? I will totally talk about that one in just a moment because I wanna show you something free before you guys go and buy full scope but I will, I'll, I'll, uh, we'll talk about it. So we are right now on the, apologies for the mic cord again. Oh my gosh, you guys are awesome for just, for bearing with me. So this is the Perry Girls TV um, egg drop page. And I bet I should zoom in for y'all. We have a viewer's monitor. We've got a heart monitor. And I just pulled this up so I don't have my comments coming through, but I just see Rick Paul is joined. I don't think I use it enough. And we're seeing the same thing. We're seeing comments come through down here as well. Vince Guzman 10 has joined. I have the Chrome store up, but not sure how to get BC Broadcaster Pro. It says added to Chrome. Is this new? This is egg drop. And so there are some new features in here. This heart monitor, that's new to me. This is a test from a cat. Hey, Bob the cat. So heart monitor. You can heart it up. You can see all of your awesome ones. Try to keep that up there. Can you keep it up at the top? Oh my gosh, it's going higher and higher. You guys are doing amazing. Isn't that fun? So you can see your comments. You can exclude different things. Michelle Hayward, thank you for inviting your followers. I appreciate that. And already, guys, as a broadcaster, I can tell you this is so much easier to be able to look over here on the computer and demo stuff on here and see your comments. I am Shawnee, welcome. Hi Vince. Now there's another little button down here below comments. And because this, you know, it's gray and black, it's a little hard to see, but it says translate. And so if you have people that comment in a different language, then you will, then you'll get, then you can translate it. Need the egg drop in the scope title for the free version. Yeah, so up here on the top, it says tip. If you use eggdorp.com in your broadcast title five times a month, you can be featured on the homepage. They also have, wow, translation. I see that. Isn't that neat? That is so cool. What a way to make the world an even smaller, more amazing place. Bonjour, ça va, says Rick Paul. Hello, how are you? Ah, je bien, et toi? Comment estas, Hannah? And look, so now, instead of just wondering if somebody is saying stuff to you in a different language, do you know if they're saying, you know, rude things? Well, instead of just blocking them, you can actually take the extra step, translate some comments. You might not be able to answer them, but at least you'll know what they're asking. And if you're demoing something, well then, sure. So when you have your name in the chat, it won't show up. So move your thing out of the chat. Healthy Hula Girl has joined. And I will say eggdrop.com is relatively new. New enough that, um, that one didn't translate, Rick. Um, new enough that you're still going to see, you know, blips and errors or weird bugs and stuff, but nothing that Nothing that's bad. Aloha from Hawaii just stays as Aloha from Hawaii. Um, nothing that breaks your broadcasts. Only things that increase, you know, your abilities on here. Joey, creator of Eggdrop, added that feature for us. Yes. And that's, that's, exact, that's a really good point, Michelle, is that this is being made by somebody that broadcasts Mm, Spanish speaking, se habla espanol, un poquito. Um, somebody that broadcasts and listens to the community. So we're seeing features that we want. Over here, you can see everybody that's in your broadcast, the current heart counts. And what I'm noticing right now, what's not coming through are the replies to comments. Why is that handy? I see, I don't know if that's on purpose, but why, you got into it, awesome, Carol. Why it's handy to not see the replies because those people aren't talking to you as the broadcaster, are they? They're talking to each other. Oh, hello, Monique. 
And so to, re to leave that out, move you guys over, so that you don't have to see it, that increases how many comments you can handle and deal with. You're not reading extra people's side conversations, which I don't mind, but can be, you know, interesting. I see some French on there. Pigs in space, moi je parle français un peu. You can speak French a little bit, and that's great. See, it doesn't maybe not translate perfect, but it's fun. It makes sense to not include other convos. It really does. Now, you can see some of your broadcasting live stats that are going on at the same time. Zoom you in. How many comments, how many hearts you guys have given, how many shares we've had, invites, screenshots, and our total number of viewers to it. It is a really cool app. And when I, you know, I brought up full scope, I want to go show you guys something that's, that's going on here. So all of these are archived broadcasts on Periscope TV. These are all ones that you can actually currently check. You can catch these in our replay list here on Periscope. But if you've noticed, they only go back about 100 broadcasts that save in your replay list. So I'm just going to keep scrolling down. This is, you know, we broadcast a lot on Perry Girls TV, right? You walk a lonely road. <laughs> I walk a lonely road. That's, I was saying that to the tune of uh, Ace of Base, but I don't know if that's true. So I'm still just scrolling, scrolling, looking at all of these. That little option right there, that means you can download the scope. So that's handy. If you forget to download it, you don't want to have um, auto save enabled on your, like to where it auto saves to your camera roll. Well, hey, what's down here? These are archived broadcasts. Wow, my finger looks really big. So you can download the archived broadcast. Did I say archived? Indeed. You can download the comments which is amazing. Well, comments download as well. No. So, so far, nothing downloads both of them together. That's unfortunate. But you can download the, the same way that Catch used to put them in a different... You're having fun seeing your comments? <laughs> Let me move them. Let me move you back up. Oh, awesome, Natasha. Thank you. I'm glad you figured it out. I'm sorry I wasn't able to like walk you through a little bit more because lately your scopes haven't been saving properly. Yeah, so go get your account on eggdrop.com. You can get a free account. There is a paid version if you want to get more features, but I just want to show you the free stuff that you guys can get at right now. So all of these broadcasts are no longer available in our replay list, but they are here on our archive. You know, you can send people to your egg drop page as well so that they can go see your archived broadcasts. Ta-da! You also have the option once you create an account. So if you don't want to be on this site, if you don't want to be on Eggdrop, because right now it just grabs everybody, you can email them and they will, you know, make your profile private. But here's what's up. You can get your free account and you can go back and you can delete your archived scope. Does this work on cell phones? Yes. You can, you can view them on cell phones. I haven't been able to see how... Like you couldn't use it on the same device at the, you know, at the same time as scope, but you can pull these up on your cell phone. Yes, indeed. You love testing it out. Me too. Whoa, that's way back here. That's way, that's crazy. Okay. Da, da, da. Well, you know what? Let's give Sage a little feature then because he likes seeing himself. Sorry, this is all, all crazy with this. Okay, well. There you go. There you go. You can see my name and your name and all of us. And there's Pete snapping a screenshot. <laughs> Blow the roof off the face base drop. Okay, I'm going to flip you guys around because that's about it. That's kind of, well, you know, I, I will flip you. First, you're just going to look at the things. Okay, there we go. So that was 25 minutes about how you can increase your engagement. Um, now, the news. I kind of alluded to this earlier on my own scope, and you're welcome, Pete. It's really good to have you here. Thank you. Um, I've been thinking about you a lot, and it's just... You guys are awesome. Howdy! Hello! So, um, full scope. We talked about that just briefly. Check your email. Whatever email you have associated with your full scope account, there is an email in there from full scope. It is no longer going to be free. It's no longer going to be free. And a lot of people are going to have a lot of things to say about whether or not full scope should be free or should be paid. But this is what I want to tell you guys. For those of you that remember when Catch left, everybody that said, oh, we would have paid for that. We could have saved it. It's, I, see tw I saw $20 a month if you're an existing full scope user to say, you know, keep it as it is. If you're using full scope and you use your analytics and you're paying attention to that stuff, totally. 
it's totally worth it. If you use full scope, then great. That's, that's your thing. Eggdrop.com will take over. And that's, oh crap, is the camera turned around? And that's kind of what I see happening too. So you can already buy into Eggdrop. You can support it and help it get better. There are paid models. Full scope right now, there is a paid model coming, but there is free Eggdrop. So the things that I showed you today, Broadcaster Pro and Eggdrop.com, free. Free. For you can, you can start right now for free and don't worry about it right? Things are worth it if you use them, you know, invest in, invest in yourself. And he wants our input and suggestions. Joey is just a wonderful dude. The customer service at Eggdrop is awesome. Um, how much for Eggdrop paid version? You can start supporting Eggdrop um, on their Patreon site, I believe. You can start supporting for a dollar a month, and I think it goes up to ten dollars a month. If you want to do a hundred, they all start out as free. Um, well, the free the free level of of full scope, as you're using it right now, will no longer be the same. Whether there's going to be a level below that, that's different. But if you're using full scope now, the full scope as you know it is going to be paid. But egg drop is real fantastic. Joey's great. You know what? Casey is a wonderful dude, too. I'm not trying to say, you know, one is better than the other. I'm trying to let you know where we stand right now as it is. A free 16-day trial on full scope, which is about two weeks. So if you already have it, we're in our two-week our two, our two week thing. Um, yes. So I recommend it. I recommend... What do I... Re I recommend it. What do I recommend? I recommend you guys try this stuff out for yourself. Test it and see what works for you. See what you enjoy using. See what your users or your viewers are enjoying and what do you feel most comfortable with as a broadcaster. Because ultimately, that's what matters. Okay, guys. I hope you had a great time. If you have more questions about this, please tweet us at Perry Girls TV. I am Hannah at Dogtown Drive. Thank you, Julie Jordan Scott. I recommend that you recommend it. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank you guys for being here. You guys are awesome. The cheapest level is free, which is awesome, which is exactly the same as the Perry Girls group. Perrygirls.com. It's our free online community. That's where all of this stuff comes from. That's where you can find me most of the time. If you're a dude, there's perrydudes.com. But girls, you got to get in this. Perrygirls.com. It's a free site where we teach things about other things and we support each other to help everybody become better at everything. So... Have a wonderful night. I am going to, of course, flip you back around and leave you on egg drop so that you can see this is your chance, put your comments in, all of this fun, and have a wonderful evening. Thank you guys so much for being here.